Puzzle Survival video. In this episode, we will be talking about how to get cheap gems or basically the most efficient way to get gems and what is the best way to spend your gems and how to get skins for cheap or the cheapest way for you to get skins. So a lot of you guys may already know how to do this, but I want to show you guys my way that I, how I've, I have been purchasing all these skins. As you may know, I have been really lucky of recently, but it's not just luck because it's been months of pulling stuff. So in the end, I've been saving a lot of money on getting gems and also on getting these gun skins. It's really, really important thing. So every single week, you gotta remember this thing called the bonus, okay? When you do these bonus, you get extra free gems every single week. So first of all, the bonus right here, just from buying gems, if you get to 1,000, 1,500, you get an extra, let me do some quick math, 500, uh, diamonds my bad diamonds diamonds okay you get diamonds now you might be thinking what is the best way to buy gems and the most efficient way for you to get your gems or your money worth on gems now in my opinion and that's just from my math that I did the best way you might think would be like oh I should buy these right here these welfare you know a thousand two hundred you get 40 advanced tickets for free bang twenty dollars what a deal so essentially this and this are all the same deal, it's just how much bulk you want to buy. I personally don't think this is the best way. And the main reason I think this is not the best way is, I'll explain to you guys in a second. If you do like buying skins, like for the uh, the, the regular skins, um, the supply, event supply drops, then go ahead buy these, it'll probably be very efficient. But I think there's a better way to do it from my math. So let's do some quick math right now, okay? So if you guys can see, if you purchase this right here, $20 Canadian, so US, I'm not sure exactly how much it's gonna cost, but $20 Canadian, you get to 1,200 gems. And usually what I will do as well, I will go to the event and I will go ahead and pull this right now. So, uh, where's this? I'm gonna do this, I'm just gonna do it right now and talk about it while we're processing the order. So basically what I recommend, so for $25, you will get the 15 gems required to get the bonus, okay? Now, usually what I recommend doing is what, is what I've been doing recently, but, I looked it up and I found that there's a way more efficient way to get your gems worth. So essentially what you're gonna do is once you finish this, okay, so think of it this way, okay, if you buy this five times, okay, that's 25, 25 times three, uh, 25 times three, 500 times three is 1,500. You get the same amount of gems. You get a little more gems here because you get the little 21 extra, I think it's 20 plus one. but. But there is a chance you get 1,200, even better chance you will get 3,000 gem. You guys probably, I probably put the clip before, I won't lie to you guys, I probably put the clip of me opening $5 worth and got the insane gem amount, 3,000 gems, which will happen occasionally, but more often than not, you'll get 300 and then I would say probably every four or five, you get 1,200 gems. So put it this way, if you get 1,200 plus 1,200, that's 2,400 gems just for the price of $25. This is the most efficient way. And as you guys can see right here, we got 321, which is the average one. But you will see that occasionally I'll put some, some screenshots or maybe not, I don't know, we'll see, of me getting either 3,000 gems or me getting either 1,200 gems. And in the long run, you will probably get more. Now, if you want, a higher risk, higher reward. You can spend the extra, let me see, one, two, three, eight dollars a day, and in three days, you'll spend $24. Now, this is my math. If you buy this, you get 1,800 gems, so 4,800. 4, so for 4,000, 4, 4, 4, 4, Jesus, math, it's hard. Sometimes, 480. So overall, you'll be down 60 gems. But, actually, I'm gonna do this real quick for you guys. But, if you want, you have a higher chance of pulling like a crazy amount because let me just do this real quick. I'm gonna buy this one for $2. You see, you have a chance to get 120, 550, 550. So, you get a higher reward to the higher risk. You get, overall, you get a little less diamonds. Jesus, I keep saying gems, but it's, it's definitely diamonds, okay? It says it right in front of me and I can't get it right. Those are the high risk reward. However, I did another quick calculation. If you buy $7 worth, so you buy this one that I'm pointing right now for $2, and then you go ahead and buy the $5 one, you will get, how much is that? It's 160, is that correct? 
I believe that's a, that's just what it says. I think I can scroll down. You get the, the the guaranteed guaranteed 120 right here, right? You get the guaranteed 120. So that's 420. 420 times four is a thousand six hundred twenty. So it's about the same value. You twenty eight dollars worth. You get a thousand six hundred. But you still get the high upside. 120, which is the minimum you get. 125. I unluckily did not get anything really good. I'm obviously gonna buy this one dollar one here. Uh, just to buy you can also spend twenty dollars worth and if you want to buy all of these all of them like one shot uh, it won't let me buy a one shot unfortunately but I wish they let you buy all three in one shot it would, it would make sense if you could buy all three in one shot but if you want to spend like for example ten dollars a day makes it twenty dollars if I do my quick map that's 60 times five three hundred so you'll you'll have actually you'll get about 300 gems for um, so for twenty dollars you get a thousand two hundred gems with the high upside of occasionally getting some crazy crazy luck. So in the long run, if you just do this part, if you only purchase the small amounts instead of doing the big portion, you'll get more gems in the long run just because you have a chance of getting 120 here. You get a little extra 300, 550 here. You might even get the six thousand. My boy JL, six thousand gems multiple times. I pull, I'll probably pull a screenshot for you guys. Bang, 6,000 gem. If you get that for the dollar value, as you guys can see, I got 60 here. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna buy really any more. Uh, I'm still processing the order, so it's kind of mad awkward. So yeah, we'll get those gems right now. Actually, I gotta check my bonuses to see how close we are. So we get got the six. All right, so I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna, I'm gonna buy both of them right now, just to, sh just to show you guys what you should do with it because hopefully we'll pull something good and not the the regular just just i just hopefully get like 250 because if you get the 250 for a dollar dollar oh it's all us yeah what am i saying it's in us prices why did i think it was canadian prices but in the dollar us prices so in the long run my best bet for me would be to open if if you're patient in five days open 25 dollars worth but spread out in the long run it will pay off because you will get the occasional thousand two hundred but if you want to spend a little more and you're a little more impatient, you can actually buy the five, like five dollars worth, and then after three, 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 and two dollars worth, and occasionally spend it. So if you want to spend fifty dollars, you'll get more for your gems or diamonds worth more for your dollar, more for your dollars worth, just because you have the upside of pulling a heck of a lot more gems. People might be like, "Oh, Hitman, it's just gambling. You're just a gambling man. You gamble so much, Hitman." Uh, yes. You are not wrong, but this is the most efficient way to get diamonds in the game. So we're gonna process this. I'll, we'll do it one more time, and then afterwards, I'm gonna show you guys what to do with your diamonds slash gems because diamonds are gems, and diamonds are a girl's best friend. Um, the confirmation. There we go. We got the 60 here. We obviously didn't get it here, but the occasional time you will get it. You will be very happy and very thankful for that. So we're gonna do it one last time. Hit that buy again button. Payment wall. Process the order. Hit that buy button, and uh, it should be the last one. Um, again, I hope this video is not too long, but it's all good. It's an informational video just for you guys to know what is the best way to get gems. Because I know a lot of people might be like, oh man, I need to get some gems. And I'm like, oh, what do I do? I'll spend $100. Relax, wait a bit, take your time. Instead of spending $100 one shot, why not spend $50 in five days? That way you have a higher upside, you get more gems. That's if you don't want the, the outfits. Obviously the outfit, you if you want to get the outfit, it's better to get those advanced tickets because advanced tickets, so essentially for $10, um, not $100, $100 give you 200 advanced tickets more, which basically is a full legendary outfit. Full legendary outfit will go for about 5,000 gems, so you're getting a little more if you want to get outfits. But I'm talking about like gun skins and stuff like that. But the main reason why I want you guys to get diamonds is because you will be able to get cheap skins with this method which i'm sure you guys already know about this i'm going to show you guys in a second you guys probably know about the tab you already know and i'm going to do a quick explanation and why i think it's the best way to get gun skins takes a little patience okay it takes a heck of a lot of patience to do this all right so we didn't get anything too crazy this time but we did did the perfect method you get a little extra gem in the long run because you get the one 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 three extra diamonds plus another seven diamonds 20 so you get an extra 20 something diamond which is fine but you get to claim all your bonuses which i will do right now to get the diamond here get those diamond here get those top up diamond here and bang you even get 10 remodel tickets which is very clutch especially if you're trying to remodel stuff to get some other skins so instead of buying these skins 
straight up you can remodel them which i think is the best way to do it now the best way to get cheap gun skin if you don't want to gamble obviously the best way to get skins is to buy it straight up okay you go to firearms you buy whatever you want straight up it's gonna always be cheaper than gambling but that's if you're not a gambling man but this is it's it's sorry it's not the cheapest way it's the most efficient way if you can't wait do it this way don't do the don't do the buy 190 multiple times in the store like this one right here don't don't do that you know don't don't do that because unless it's this one the monthly supply definitely worth it best 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 thing because think of it this way 300 pulls you'll guarantee an epic look a legendary look and an old moon plus generally you'll get more stuff let's be honest you'll have a higher upside of getting other stuff so spend your gem if you're trying to go and spend your gem on outfit this is the best way to get the gun and the outfit which also this is a great skin to be honest with you guys the outfit the mask actually is probably the best part now if you want to bet straight up spend gems purchase stuff from the store because for example parabat absolutely amazing speaking of that i should just buy it right now in case i forget parabat very nice outfit right there you definitely want to pick that up you want to get maybe the backpacks you i recommend picking a set don't go for like oh i want to pick because in the long run it's gonna be more expensive so for just for like the level three backpack why get this if you can pay 200 more to get the full set if you want to get that because there is some good good sets out there like there's also the i mean this one is not bad nothing is going to beat the dragon one you're going to see in the back can you actually sort them by legendary price by high to low so yeah some and and if you want nice skins i recommend buying the full set but don't buy these right here these 3000 gems one these are way too expensive and these are just stuff you got for free i recommend buying something like this the white butler that's nice thousand five hundred maybe not the gun skin this this is nice you know some of these are pretty sick you know what i mean like oh that's actually decent this one not bad thousand gem you know there's some decent ones out there like this mask this bunny outfit robs loves this one there's some really good ooh, like this right here this is a sick outfit for only 700 gems so if you're trying to just get diamonds jesus whatever gems and diamonds are the same thing i don't care anymore in the chat so if you're trying to get some nice skins look at that look 700 this is a sick outfit not as great as the advanced one but like this is amazing it's only 600 this is 500 like look at these it's female outfits a lot of people like using a male outfit like this is really nice like there's some great outfits out here actually i'm gonna show you guys one of the nicest outfits in here in the game like these are these are okay they're decent you can get the backpacks obviously i was talking about not the football one where is those other ones there's a lot of nice 300 diamond outfits uh, look at those personalities personalities boys and girls uh yeah these these are sick like you get th this outfit right here like that's sick you get this outfit right here for like 300 diamonds you get the monkey outfit for 900 diamonds there is so many great outfits and you can even get these cr eh, this mask is okay i'll be honest with y'all but there's some nice to put your halloween's coming up you know they might do a halloween special outfit like some of these are just so nice for so cheap like if you want to get a nice outfit just buy it from the store straight up now for the cheap skins, obviously you already probably knew about this where I'm coming in. So um, this page right here, limited time special offer. You can buy this every single week. Top up bonus diamonds, US offer. So I recommend doing this every single week just because in the long run, even if you're pulling a lot, like let's say even here, think of it this way. If you pull it a hundred times, it's still gonna be cheaper than buying it straight up because that's a thousand, even pulling it 200 times. It's still cheaper and it's already cheaper than buying it in the store where it's going to be so so in the long run we're going to try out and see we're probably not going to pull it just because my luck has been really good of recently but it's best i recommend just the gun skins in general because generally you're saving like 90 percent compared to like the car skins uh i've pulled a heck of a lot of skins from this from doing this every single day two pro as well these skin you might be able to get these are actually believe it or not more common than you think. I've actually pulled like a lot of legendaries from those and a lot of epics from those. And with those, whatever you don't like, you can remodel to get what, all oh, right, let me go back to the event then. Sorry, man, my apologies. I didn't mean to click away. So like, I recommend doing all the skins that you don't have. Even if you don't want it, you might as well do it because there's the, the, the upside of actually pulling. Worst case, you get gold, whatever, but there's an upside to get these advanced tickets, which are super, super useful obviously if you already have the gun skin do not roll for it again because having duplicates of gun skin is useless all you get is 
stupid puzzles, which is absolutely stupid. Not even the good puzzles. Those terrible blue puzzles. If, you, if they gave purple puzzle, it would make sense. Which you would think they would give you is purple puzzles, but they don't give you purple puzzles, which is kind of stupid because, like, I pulled two of the AKM skin. And it really didn't want to, it, it just, I'll show you guys. You know what, I'll just show you guys. It'll be a lot easier. You guys will see. I actually don't have these skins right here. So I'm going to try to pull them. You guys can see, like, right here, the Sakura, the Devil Eye, the Leopard. I already have that, so I'm not even going to bother. I already have. So the monster truck, that's where it's a little iffy. If you want to spend diamonds on a vehicle, choose one. Choose one and commit to that one the whole season until you pull it. Don't just, like, because if you go for everything, the chance of you pulling it is going to be rare. Pick which one you want. I So, so for example, the monster truck, I committed in the monster truck, I got it. After that, I committed to getting the, the Pegasus, and I got it. So I committed. Now I'm committed into getting the Bugatti or Lamborghini. I think it's a Bugatti. I don't know. Whatever you guys want to think. So I'm going to definitely try to pull that. I'm going to do the Singularity AKM skin because as much as I like the Frost one, um, it would be great. Like I said, worst case, you can get some good stuff like Twilight ACR. Although I'm pretty sure this is a trading manual one, so there's really no point of me pulling it, but I might get advanced tickets. So right here, we're going to try to get the Spark skin. Uh, I'm not going to get it, but 200 coins, not bad. Jade, anytime you want. Like, I think you, on average, you'll spend like six, seven hundred dollars if you try to get everything. If you just get the gun skin, you'll spend like, not dollars, diamonds. If you spend just on these, you get like 300. Again, pick what you want. I want also the he's either the rosy or the challenger, so I'm not gonna actually try for that. I do want to get this, so I'm gonna try to get that. Unfortunately, I've been really unlucky today. I haven't actually pulled some crazy stuff. And this is clutch because on average you'll get the three, but every I think five you'll get 15. So I got three today, which is not the best. Like I already have this one, the demon pack or the handgun. I'm not gonna bother. Just because I'm not no point. But like the pew pew pack, I'm gonna, I want it. You know, there's like the more you pull, the higher chance you have of getting it. And then this is definitely the best one. And I'll, I'll definitely roll some clips in the background of me pulling some of these insane pulls. Maybe I'll cut out the video. Like Feast Pack, you know, you, there's no downside. You know, just might as well. I know I don't want it. You know, just like, just to have the skin. You know, I don't have the SVD skin. I'll just pull for it. Um, Poison Pack, AR-15, you know what? Heck, why not? You know, Rainbow, why not? You know, give yourself the chance to pull something good. Maybe they nerfed it, like AKM I already have. This one, why not? I don't have the Sea Spirit skin. Why not just try it, you know? There's no, literally the downside is that you spend half the gem, but in the long run, you'll at least get some gold, at least get some some fire pulled, you know, Death Stalker, one of the first AR-15 skins. You get the Zeus as well. You know, we'll try it. You know, you gotta do on everything. You gotta do everything. You got the, the, the Grave Digger SVD. Is that SVD? What gun is that? I'm trying to remember. But like, you know, it's, it's a gamble, obviously, but it's the best way to get a band ticket. Actually, I'll take that. Ice Dragon. I already did a Zulong. Dang. I already have the health. I don't have the health bar. So might as well do it. Wild Dragon, I don't have either. So we're going to try it out. And then finally, Dark Wukong. Always nice to try out the Dark Wukong. So as you guys can see, I spent approximately, I think I like five, 550. I'm not sure exactly how much it is. But today we were unlucky, but generally as it progresses, if you want, also don't forget, if you want to spend a little bit of money, I highly recommend getting at least the little pack here. Uh, where is it? The weekly? Where is my welfare? Do your weekly. The weekly is generally pretty cheap. And it's for me, I got it for 14 days. Make sure you do the first time because it's pretty cheap the first time you do it. Like the monthly pass. Those are good. In the long run, you get so much gems. Ooh, I got a burp. So yeah, definitely worthwhile if you guys are trying to spend gems. This is the best way. So yeah, make sure you do those daily ones. At least do the 10 gem ones. Don't have to do the car one. Don't have to do the training point. I'm doing the training point just because I'm trying to make the video go out. But um, yeah, just that's what I think, you know. So hopefully you guys uh, found this useful. All right, that's it for today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to hit a thumbs up. Don't forget to let me know in the comments down below if you guys found this useful or not. Legit, this is the way that I should have started spending my um, buying gems instead i was really on well i guess i was doing it for videos but if you're trying to be like realistically speaking that's the best way to do it like by every single day splitting it up i've been doing that recently now i did some quick math but the buying gun skins i basically never buy any gun skins oh actually before we end this let me show you guys to prove to you the convert repeats okay watch this deep freeze 250 that's it doo doo Everything anyway, let me show you guys all the skins. The only skin that I bought, I believe, is the AKM skin. And 
and um, I think that's it. Maybe the Annihilator. I probably pulled the Annihilator. Like not that many. Like I pulled so many gun skins, like which is ridiculous. And it's in the long run, it was cheaper for me to do it that way. If you want to see my latest video, just give me the right side of the screen. If you haven't yet, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and make videos on it daily. All right, I'm out. See you guys next time. Kill it. <laughs>